Hello friends, welcome again to the world of Maths by Yumi. This one is the third question of Quantability. Sorry, बहुत सारे breaks हो गए थे बीच में, so मैं update नहीं कर पाया video. Now I'll update video on a regular basis. So this one is the third question of Quantability. Question is in front of you. अगर आपने solve नहीं किया है, तो solve करो. Else check the solution and solve the homework. Okay? So question is quite easy. In the below given series, how many numbers are perfect cube? Before solving this question, let's understand what do we mean by perfect cube, okay? So the word is nothing but perfect cube in the form of a raised to power b. So we have two things. One is the base, one is the power. So there are three cases of becoming a perfect cube. There are three cases in which we can say number is a perfect cube. The first case is when power is divisible by 3 and both are nothing but the integers. If power is divisible by 3, we can say it's a perfect cube because cube means power is 3 or 3 ka multiple. For example, 5 raised to power 6 is a perfect cube and is the perfect cube of 5 is square. It's a perfect cube. Case number 1. Case number 2. When base is a perfect cube in itself. For example, 8 raised to power 8 is a perfect cube how comes we can write 8 is nothing but 2 cube raised to power 8 and if we interchange the power this one is nothing but 2 8 raised to power 3. So this one is a perfect cube of 2 8 because we know a m raised to power n is nothing but a raised to power m into n or a raised to power n into m. By this calculation we can say 8 raised to power 8 is a perfect cube. So our first condition is either power is the perfect cube or base is the perfect cube and third is nothing but the mixture of both which one is nothing but both the cases power is divisible by 3 and base is a cube. So this one is the overlap of both. So if we say in the set theory this one is the set A this one is the set B so this one is the set A intersection B or we can say if I say power is divisible by 3 set a is a cube then then this portion is the third case and we can easily say if we have to find all the values if we want to get all the values that means all three we have to use nothing but a union b and the a union b is nothing but a plus b minus a intersection b in the number wise so we have to find set 1 we have to find set 2 and we have to find set 3 we have to add both and subtract the set 3. So this one is how we calculate a perfect cube in the search or any power in the search. I hope it is clear. So we have to work on three cases and work accordingly with this formula. Fine. So now solve the question. Ko. Our question is we need to find perfect cube. So the case 1. Case 1 is what? A raised to power B power is divisible by 3. So our first power jo divided by 3 hoga, wo hoga 3 1 se leke 366 plus 2. It means ke 1 se start hote hue 366 tak gaya hai. To is this is case mein we have 366 perfect cubes when the power is divided by 3. Now the second case. Base is a perfect cube. 1 is a perfect cube. Then the 8 is the perfect cube. Which one is nothing but 2 cube. Then the 27 is the perfect cube. The last perfect cube, we will get nothing but 10 cube is nothing but a 1000. Because when we find the 11 cube, it's 13, 31, which one is out of the range. So we have 1, 2, 3, up to 10. We have 10 such values. So we can say, first we have the 366. Second case, we have 10. Now we want overlap. Now, how can we find the overlap? Overlap ka matlab, isme mujhe wo sare numbers dekhne honge. Jo mere is case may be hai. Means mujhe dekhna kya hoga. I have to check 27 raised to power 27. So the first number jo dekhega wo 27 raised to power 27 means 3 ka cube dekhega. Then mujhe 6 ka cube pay power 6 ka cube. That means nothing but 216 raised to power 216 ko ignore karna hoga. Then we have 9 cube raised to power 9 cube. Jo tiyo jay dekhega. So we have 366 numbers. We have nothing but 10 numbers here and the 3 numbers of the intersection. The answer of this question is 366 plus 10 minus 3. So this value becomes nothing but 373 and answer of this question is 373 only. So I hope ye aapka clear. Aapko karna kuch nahi hai. 
पहला केस दूसरा केस और तीसरे केस को निकालो आप इसे निकालना बहुत ईजी है थ्री के मल्टीपल्स को चेक करना है कहाँ तक जाता है इसे निकालने के लिए थोड़ा सा मैनुअल प्रोसेस करते हैं वन क्यूब टू क्यूब अप टू टेन क्यूब तक जाएगा ओवरलैप में इस वैल्यूज में मुझे देखना है कि कौन कौन थ्री से डिवाइड हो रहा है दैट इज थ्री क्यूब डिवाइड होगा सिक्स क्यूब डिवाइड होगा नाइन क्यूब डिवाइड होगा एंड दोनों केसेस को ऐड करना है इंटरसेक्शन पार्ट को सब करना है एंड वी विल गेट दी आंसर ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन आई होप क्लियर है ऐसे कितने भी क्वेश्चन आए आप इसे सॉल्व करो क्यूब का मतलब होता है पावर डिविजिबल बाई थ्री तो अगर आपको कोई भी डाउट हो आई वुड से प्लीज रिवाइंड द वीडियो एंड ट्राई टू सॉल्व द क्वेश्चन आंसर ऑफ दिस क्वेश्चन इज 373। नाउ आपके लिए होमवर्क है एंड होमवर्क इज दिस क्वेश्चन क्वेश्चन इज इन द बिलो गिवन सीरीज सीरीज वही है हाउ मेनी नंबर्स आर परफेक्ट स्क्वायर्स आपको ये बताना है कितने नंबर परफेक्ट स्क्वायर्स है तो डू योर कैलकुलेशन फाइंड द सेट वन सेट टू एंड इंटरसेक्शन पार्ट एंड गेट दी आंसर कोई भी डाउट हो आप मुझको पिंक कीजिए कहीं भी सोशल नेटवर्किंग साइट पर आई ट्राई टू गिव माई लेवल बेस्ट and with all the best wishes myself from me god bless you happy learning and bye bye